The Apollo program was a series of human spaceflight missions conducted by NASA with the goal of landing astronauts on the moon. The program spanned from 1961 to 1972 and achieved its historic milestone with the Apollo 11 mission. Apollo 11, launched on July 16, 1969, was the culmination of years of planning, engineering, and testing. The crew consisted of three astronauts, Neil Armstrong, Buzz Aldrin, and Michael Collins. Their spacecraft, named Apollo 11, comprised the Command Module CM named Columbia and the Lunar Module LM named Eagle. After a journey of approximately 240,000 miles, the spacecraft entered lunar orbit on July 19, 1969. Armstrong and Aldrin transferred to the lunar module and began their descent to the Moon's surface. On July 20, 1969, at 2017 Universal Time Coordinated, the Lunar Module Eagle touched down in the Sea of Tranquility, marking the first manned landing on the moon. Neil Armstrong, the mission commander, famously took the first step onto the lunar surface, stating that S1 small step for a man, one giant leap for mankind. Buzz Aldrin soon followed, and together they conducted experiments, collected samples, and planted the American flag. They spent approximately two and a half hours outside the lunar module before returning inside. Meanwhile, Michael Collins remained in lunar orbit aboard the command module, conducting experiments and providing crucial support to the mission. He played a vital role in the mission's success by maintaining communication with Earth and ensuring the safe return of the crew. After spending about 21 hours on the lunar surface, Armstrong and Aldrin blasted off from the moon in the ascent stage of the lunar module. They docked with the command module, and the crew began their journey back to Earth. Apollo 11 successfully splashed down in the Pacific Ocean on July 24, 1969. The crew was recovered by the USS Hornet, and their safe return marked the triumphant conclusion of the historic mission. The Apollo 11 mission was a significant achievement for humanity, representing a major milestone in space exploration and a testament to human ingenuity and determination. It expanded our understanding of the moon, provided valuable scientific data and samples, and inspired generations of future astronauts and scientists. Certainly. Here are some additional details about the Apollo 11 mission. Upon landing on the moon, Neil Armstrong and Buzz Aldrin had several objectives to fulfill. They deployed scientific instruments, including seismometers to study moonquakes, a laser-ranging retroreflector for precise distance measurements, and a passive seismic experiment package PSEP to monitor thermal and seismic activity. They also collected nearly 50 pounds, 22 kilograms of lunar soil and rock samples, which they carefully documented and packaged for return to Earth. One iconic moment of the mission was the planting of the American flag on the lunar surface. The flag, designed with a horizontal rod to create the appearance of waving in the airless environment, served as a symbol of the United States achieved. During their extravehicular activities EVAs, Armstrong and Aldrin also set up experiments like the lunar dust detector, which measured the electrostatic charge and movement of lunar dust. They deployed a solar wind composition SWC experiment, which captured particles from the solar wind to analyze its composition and characteristics. The lunar module itself had limited space and consumables, including oxygen, water, and power. To ensure a safe return, the LM ascent stage had to rendezvous and dock with the command module, which carried Collins in lunar orbit. Collins performed vital tasks such as navigating the spacecraft, conducting experiments, and taking photographs of the lunar surface. After the lunar surface activities were complete, the LM ascent stage fired its engine to launch back into lunar orbit, where it successfully docked with the command module. The crew transferred back to the command module, and the LM was jettisoned, eventually crashing onto the Moon's surface. The return journey to Earth took approximately three days. The command module re-entered the Earth's atmosphere, protected by its heat shield, which experienced temperatures up to 5,000 degrees Fahrenheit, 2,800 degrees Celsius. The parachutes deployed, and Apollo 11 splashed down safely in the Pacific Ocean. 